Hi, this is a quick demo of my new project called Markdown Editor with the WISI, WIG controls, which means you get a very easy user-friendly editor. Uh, you don't need to remember much syntax about Markdown. You just have to click the buttons and the syntax gets generated automatically. Once all syntax uh, is being prepared by you, you can upload it, save it and upload it with whatever favorite editors you want. You can save it and upload it to your uh, collaboration sites. So I will give you the download links, download links for this uh, zip file, uh, this web-based template, uh, which you can use locally. I will give you the do download link in the description, description box below so you can download and benefit. I'll give you a quick demo of uh, this now. So if you notice, I, this is the zip file that I prepared and this is a folder which it will extract to. And there are three files there. So you have to double click on the index.html and then this is the editor interface that gets opened automatically. And uh, you have all these buttons at the top which will make, your, make our life very easy. It generates the markdown syntax automatically. So we just have to type our text. Let's say some text I will type and select it. And if I click on hit the header one button, it will generate the header on the right side. You can see it is generated it automatically. Uh, so that's how easy it is. So the markdown, that line markdown special syntax is ready. So if you want to go to the next line, do double spaces and press enter according to the markdown syntax and then uh, let's say some other text some other let's say i'll put some other and this time i will select it as bold so you can see it has become bold now uh, or i can undo and select something else block coat block coat it will add so like this lot of things are there so I can control Z or command Z to undo everything here. So let's see if anything else. Main purpose of Markdown is for coding purposes. You can represent your codes very well. So let's say I select everything and either I can, uh, if it is a single line, I click code in line. This is a multi line, I can click the code block. So immediately code block, once I click it, it will generate this nice a colorful uh, code block and then there are very easy things like image insertions like I click on insert image immediately image uh, gets inserted and uh, sample image gets inserted so you have to change your HTTPS link up to this JPEG file you have to change the link and it will refer to the new file automatically so like that I can click on a uh, website link insert it like this and then I can click on the tables or immediately a table gets uh, a sample table gets prepared so you can just edit the table headings and the core data and your data is ready so once you are ready with all your changes just save it control command a or control a so uh, control c that or con command c that and paste it in your editor favorite editor and save it any editor like sublime text or genie or kate so you can use any of these uh, free cross platform editors of course, Sublime Text is a paid version. Uh, they give you a trial period, but other editors are very free and you can use them very well in your projects. I think this covers it. So please explore all these buttons and see once you select the text, you have to click the button, appropriate button, and it will help you out. I've given a short uh, help test also here so you can view it. I think that's it. It's very simple and easy project, making markdown syntax very easy for you. Okay, so uh, if you like my presentation, do press the like button. Also uh, comment, share and subscribe to my channel. Also pass on this message to your friends and colleagues so that they can help out other departments and organizations. So thank you for watching and have a nice day.